Hey folks, despite sports and a strict diet, you just can't seem to take those pounds off. Today we'll show you why it's not always so easy to remove weight, and why for some it may be psychological. But before the hate wave starts, we're not talking about unnatural model dimensions. And yes, we know that some people are overweight due to illnesses and cannot help it or change it. So, let's go! Number 5. Obesity is comfortable. And by this we mean the psychological point of view. Maybe you're lonely, you don't have your dream job, or you're not reaching certain goals in life. It's always easy to push this into your weight and keep it in your subconscious rather than confront it in reality. Number 4. Laziness and excuses. Obese people often postpone their plans. You want to learn to dance, for example, but can't because you're overweight. Or you can't jog for so long because you're overweight. And of course, the fact that these activities would help you lose weight even more makes it easier to ignore them more and more. Yeah, it's like a hamster wheel. Number 3. Attention. Who doesn't like a bit of attention? Psychologists have found that it's more important to some people to complain about their diet or their strict fitness trainer rather than achieve the attended aim and have nothing to complain about anymore. Number 2. Suppression. Under stress, most people eat. Add to this stress a new diet or heavy exercise, and thus the goal of losing weight might actually be achieved. But not always is a radical change in diet or a tough workout plan the right way, though. Psychologists have discovered that emotions such as fear and hunger are similar in the brain. So instead of a fitness trainer, a therapist might even be able to help you lose weight. And finally, number one, low self-esteem. Morbid obesity can be very harmful to the heart and bones. Unfortunately for some people, it's difficult to do anything about it, because sometimes people are able to convince themselves that they're fine. Dietitians often hear phrases like, my hips are beautiful, so you can love me more, or big cheeks are my style. Another excuse is, my mom or dad was overweight. In fact, parents only inherit a predisposition for weight and are not entirely to be blamed. What you have to do is confront the truth head on, and get ready to tackle this as a real problem if you actually want things to change. Okay folks, I hope these tips were helpful. If you like this video, why not check out another one right here. Until next time, bye.